Oh yeah, here we go. Just love playing on the jet ski. Woohoo! Let's get to it. Does anybody else just sit down in the shop on their nice comfy couch? It might be a little infested, but and just enjoy their machinery like me? No? Alright, I got big news. Big news. So, I got an inheritance. One of my... what? I get a lot of inheritance, but this is just money. Just some cash. Some dough. So, I'm gonna finally give my wife what she's been asking for for a long, long time. All you are probably like, really? get more cash so this isn't a lot of cash so so if you know I've gotten a few inheritance from my uncle passing away and everything and every single one has come with additional uh, let's say debt uh, so mostly this inheritance is gonna pay off my debt if you didn't know I have been racking up the debt like crazy around this place so I think pretty much as long as I don't spend too much money on my wife's dream, we will be debt free. That is one huge, huge, especially in today's time, convenient. I'm so excited to be debt free for once. This has been a long time coming. If you don't know, we are uh, going to feed our uh, cattle here, if it's not already apparent to you. And let's see, about right there is good. Love this truck. Love my hydro bed. So convenient. Ugh. Ugh. Getting a little sticky. Sticky icky. Open up the gate. Now let's get down here. Don't you even think about it. I'm shutting it. So, of course. We gotta feed our uh, horses and cattle, so I like feeding them um, in two different areas just so both of them don't get in any uh, fights, arguments, but for the most part the horses have been leaving the cattle alone. Pretty happy about that. Ooh, wow, that bale is all over the place. Yeah, hey, you come and get your feed here? There you go. There you go. Hold on. Still getting used to these controls. Yep. Move that back there. Hold them in. Oh, oh. Too far. Too far. All right. Here we go. All right. Horses are fed. Yeah, you can go eat it too. Don't worry. Sorry, I cut off the cow train there a little bit. Alright, so now I gotta get the 8330 ready for some tillage. You're probably like, uh, how is that your wife's dream? Well, you're gonna see. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's why I got the mudders on here. Need it for this uh, mud pit right here. All of you are probably screaming at me right now. Why aren't you using the Versatile? I was just joking. I'm not going to use the 83. You think I'd uh, give up a chance to use my uh, big old Versatile for the first time? Yep. Going to use it. Just got to unhook this. All right. We are hooked up. So I'm going to use my John Deere disc. And uh, I'm going to break up some ground over here on our new ground we just purchased. Oh, oh. Well, uh, I'm going to have to have some ear pro if I'm going to run this down the road. That thing is loud. Real loud. 
Where did I put them? Oh, here we go. Yep. Definitely gotta have some earplugs or something. Guess I'm gonna have to open up this gate before I go too far. I'm not gonna get very far without that. Alright, you beautiful big V8. Screen down the highway or the road. It's a thing of beauty, isn't it? Oh. I know y'all have been saying that this is versatile wasn't made in the US so I know I call it US primarily because I grew up around versatiles and they were always in the fields pulling the big implement to me they're American classic but I know they're made in Canada doesn't mean they can't be American classic though all right here we are so you guys are probably still wondering what are you doing don't worry. This, this is my wife's dream. Uh, I think I took the wrong way. Yeah. Can't go that way. You do. Yep, gotta go around. I know, I know. This is a new field. You're gonna have to forgive me. Gotta go around these tree sets. This is not where I wanna be. This is not where we're gonna be breaking the ground. Put that beautiful disc in the ground. Listen to that V8 purr. You guys are probably like, how in the world is this your wife's dream? Well, we gotta break some ground because we're gonna be building. We're gonna be building a beautiful little vacation home so you guys are probably like oh sure you're gonna waste your money on vacation home no it's going to be a rental and we're gonna enjoy it uh, you know life isn't all about buying the newest 8rx John Deere it's about it enjoying it sometimes that is building a beautiful vacation spot so I'm gonna basically be plowing this up because we are gonna have to move a lot of dirt and I mean a lot of dirt so uh, we are going to make a man lake or man pond more like it so you know me I'm a big fisherman so I want to have a basically a little summer home right by a beautiful fishing pond where I can with with some beautiful Florida Florida strain big bass and some uh, big old crappie oh my first truckers coming over here look at that beautiful thing over there yeah hauling the big equipment we got a lot of dirt to move oh that is that trucker is always around here got a lot of uh, big equipment to haul over here so it looks like we got a giant excavator so I think that's gonna primarily dig out this pond We're gonna need more than that that's gonna be a while if this has to dig out the pond that's why I'm helping over here I'm just trying to break up this sod for them maybe take a little bit less time a little bit less less money out of my pocket ah we got another load coming already here looks like uh, what do we got now we got a big dirt moving truck just doing the second pass around here just to uh, break up this sod this sod has been growing for a while so I think this is about done once we get around here, I don't know if uh, it will really pay to do anything more. I think she almost has the last piece of equipment. Yeah, here she comes again. Man, she is a hauling machine. What do we got this time? Oh, we got a big old 
bulldozer there. All right, that's the last of it. Gotta fold this up, take the long journey home. Well, we got a little of the hot. Hoppity hoppity hop, hoppity hop. It's kind of odd. Must have got some air in the hy hydraulics. All right, I'm gonna take this screaming demon back home. Leave these people to it. If I'm lost along the way If I wander off onto a different trail Will you forgive me if I fail When I'm lost and erased If I cry when I'm blue If I cry alone when I am with you 
Oh yeah, here we go. Just love playing on the jet ski. Woohoo! Yep, I probably forgot to take my pants off. Probably should have put my swim trunks on, don't you think? But we got done. So this is going to be our party house or uh, rental house, whatever you want to call it. So it's always been my uh, wife's dream. We'll just beat you. I know that's bad on him, but uh, why not? It's the squad's mobile, so we'll just do that to his. Don't tell him. Shh. But uh, it's always been my wife's dream to have basically a vacation house. Uh, I have always loved the cabin look. Kind of look at the little troughs up there on the roof. Looks like two dogs. But I love the log cabin with the big old fireplace. Look at this big old 
put a whole bunch of logs in there and burn. Uh, we also got our fire pit right here. I know this is really just a planner, but we're going to use it as a fire pit. Hey, because this is our reality. But just love the rocking chairs around. Then we got their beautiful pond here. We do some uh, frog fishing with our uh, little uh, bass boat slash crappie boat, whatever you want to call it. But you could use whatever boat you want it for. But uh, do some little frog fishing over there in the cattails or the lily pads. Uh, that would be great uh, bass cover slash crappie. Or we could take the jet skis out and scare them fish out. I just love this place. And while we are farming and we can't be here, we could just uh, rent it out to a few lucky people that get to stay here. Man, hopefully one day we all will be blessed and have enough money to have a giant rental property. You guys will have to let me know what your dreams are. This has always been my dream to have a basically a vacation home slash rental property where I can basically build it however I like it. Even have my own little garage in here. I know I got the Model A out over here. We'll have to take that back, but we I just figured I'd get it over here and get it to running, hopefully. But hopefully you all enjoyed this. If, if you did, don't forget smash that like button it helps me out it helps all the youtubers out never forget to like the video if you did enjoy it catch you next time thank you all for watching like comment and share and subscribe all right let's see how far we can launch the squad mobile Woo! oh we hit the fence Later, guys, and girls.